Hi, I'm Ralph Diamitis. I'm the author or co-author of tour books about wine country, specifically Napa and Sonoma, and I'd like to introduce you to our newest additions to the catalog. Now, we started working on tour books about wine country back in 2005, and over the years we've produced a whole series of them, you know, and as wine country has changed and the demands have changed, we have adapted our books. Over the last 10 years, we've mostly done smaller books because the changes have been quite dramatic, but updating these big books takes a lot of time, and we've been busy. We have a busy publishing company, and we also run a tour company that grew out of our research called Amici Tours. In fact, the name of our little publishing imprint is Amici Tour and Travel Books. It's actually part of our larger uh, publishing company. Well, thanks to the quarantine... We now had about a year or so to update the big books. And when we came out with the new versions, we, should, we said, you know, this should really say what it is. The way we developed these books initially was I went and got a job driving tours. And we were doing research on actually a different book, a book about winery buildings, but it very quickly morphed into the first tour book. And the new books really are a tour guides Napa Valley and a tour guides Sonoma wine country. It's very much the insider's point of view about what makes this area special and how to have a fantastic time visiting here. I mean, visit in a way in which you feel comfortable and at home and welcome and you don't feel like an idiot because I don't know very much about wine. Guess what? You probably know much more about wine then you realize because you've been drinking it for a while and your body has not forgotten any flavor and any scent of any wine you've ever tasted. You know much more than you realize, but what our books will help you do is navigate the area easily, to know what to expect inside the tasting rooms, to know how to navigate around a valley safely when there's a lot of people on the road who have been drinking and you're going down these narrow little country roads. Our maps are the best in pine country and I know that because for many years the hotels used our maps and they're keyed to the directory. Now the way the books are laid out is really interesting. The first six chapters are essentially Come into wine country. How do you get here? Well, what do you expect when you do get here? How do you taste wine? Most people, you know, you pay, you pick up the wine, you drink it. Well, yeah, but there's other ways you can taste it that are really going to help you understand the wine in a better way. The next six chapters in each book speak about the specific county. There's Napa County and there's Sonoma County. And it's going to help you understand those specific regions. Uh, where are you going to go? Where are you going to visit within the counties? Like, for instance, Sonoma's big. Sonoma's three times bigger than Napa. You know, you come to Sonoma, I want to visit the place that makes the wines I like. Where is that? It's an awful big county. You know, you want to go to uh, Alexander Valley. Well, I love Pinot Noir. Alexander Valley grows Merlot and Cabernet Sauvignon. That would be a good thing to know. Who makes Pinot Noir? Down the road in Russian River Valley. And there's maps for all of those. Now, after the first six chapters and the second six chapters, there's actually seven chapters, which are the answers. These are the answers to the most commonly asked questions. For instance, how do I dress? You know, how do I ship the wine home? I mean, these are basic things, but we get asked all the time. The answers are there in very short, little, easy to read chapters. So when you're going in the contents, you don't have to read the whole book if you want. Go to the sections that are helpful to you. Then the second half of the book is, are the directories. But within the directories, which give you all kinds of details about the winery, all the contact information, our comments from having visited the place many, many times, they're also keyed to the maps. All of the maps are at the back of the book so that you can access them easily when you're tra traveling around wine country. And they have these large letters 
up in the corners so that you can go to them quickly when you're driving down the road because otherwise they're not useful, right? There's also a little um, bonus. There's some bonuses in the books. There's some chapters from another book we're working on called Wine Country and Shorts, and they add some color. These are the stories that we've been telling over our shoulders for years to clients about the region. And it's really an amazing, it's an amazing region. Uh, the stories here are, are, they're fun, they're interesting, they, they're historical many times. And there are little fillers in there, they give you a little color. Now, Sonoma does have one additional chapter that Napa doesn't have. It's about visiting wine country with children. Okay, Sonoma's a big agricultural county with beautiful redwood trees and a beautiful coast and beautiful plazas. There's lots of things that you can do with children there while visiting the wineries. Not so much in Napa. Napa's about making wine. So those are the two books. Uh, they go for $24.95. Each one's 200 pages. They are the current information about this region. Uh, we do our best in each new printing to keep them current. And I hope you find them helpful. You can find them on Amazon. You can find them through your bookstores. And you can find them through our website, amicitours.com. Enjoy and have fun traveling.